have it. <laughs> I love being warm. You guys are kicked out of the house. Look at them. Look at them. I used to go here, it felt like. And then I just said, me. <laughs> hey you guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here thank you so much for being here my name is tile and this is a channel all about love goofiness and all things tile okay so today's tuesday this is i'm starting off the week today technically in a way i already started off the week this week obviously monday but i didn't vlog yesterday because there was a lot going on anyway it is Practically afternoon. I just made myself a bit of lunch. Hello fresh. It's so Good. I think this was the tilapia meal. I forgot what it's called, but I will, I'll put it right here. I'll put it there. Why is this so bright? It's so bright in here. Anyway, it's fine Yeah, so I'm just eating my breakfast lunch I know it's tilapia, but I just wanted to eat like real food not like breakfast isn't real food, but I'm not really a breakfast person. So I was like, mm, let me cook, eat, because it's closer to the afternoon, and then I'll eat the rest for dinner. Anyway, it's not that deep. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to come on here and start the week with you guys. Let me know how you're doing, and down in the comments. Hope you guys are doing well. Uh, what am I doing today? I'm working, going to my parents' house to help them with some... I'm literally the family's project manager, y'all. I am literally, if you are the eldest in an African family, you know you're the family's project manager. Whatever. Um, I'm gonna go help them with a project that's going on. They have contractors coming over to fix the house. There's a lot going on. They're renovating the house, so I'm gonna go help them do that. I'm gonna be working while I'm supervising, so I'm doing two jobs. It's fine. Then I'm just probably gonna go to the gym and hang out with people later. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Anyway, I'll see you guys in a bit. Hey friends. How are y'all doing? How's your day going? It is summer. Well, not summer, it's spring. And it's so hot outside. I guess I said summer because it's so warm today. It's about 80 something degrees right now and I am so happy. <laughs> I love being warm. I love it. Like, I love the sun on me. I like that I'm like naked according to the saints. Like, my shoulders are showing. <laughs> That's nakedness. When your shoulders and your clavicle are showing. Anyway, um, yeah, my sister and I are going to the coffee shop to study and work while well, she's studying. I'm working. I should study today, but I'm gonna study later this weekend. I'm just gonna be editing a vlog. That should have been out already, but this week has been crazy. Like, this week has been like, I'm busy, I'm tired, there's a lot going on. It's been wild. So, we're just gonna stay focused in here, in this here coffee shop, and get work done. I look really cute. Those are the clothes from the wedding that I am taking to the dry cleaners to get cleaned and steamed out, sanitized, all that. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, see you soon. Wait, so I need to talk to my lawyer about <laughs> Talk to him. Hi. 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 How y'all doing? Pretty good. What are you doing? Um, this is our housewives moment, our lunch. Talking about our classmates. <laughs> <laughs> We're just giving updates. Just updates. Life yeah. updates. Just um, updates. The, the life and times of our law school. Exactly. Oh, on a good note, positive note, I mean, we're not graduating, but it's a flex, but we have the Supreme Court Justice, Kataji Brown Jackson, mm. as our speaker for graduation. So, the what justice. law school got Kataji? We did. WCL. First. But you're not graduating, though. Doesn't, Doesn't matter. matter. It's our flex. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. My mentor is. <laughs> anyway. Guys. We came to this coffee shop. What's it called? Love, love, love life, love. Life. That's the that's the um, Kingsway son. Oh really? Yeah, that's her small son. Town. The <laughs> such a small town Laurel. Anyway, we came to the oh love life coffee. We came here and I got a grapes, grapefruit and ginger juice. 
I got my coffee and of course I got a coffee cake that's chocolate and I'm editing guys the video that should have went out yesterday I'm editing so it'll come out it'll come out just don't judge me I'm sorry I'm so sorry hey guys why do I have shoes in my hand okay the reason is my sister and I went out, right? We were just in the coffee shop, then we went to Home Goods. While we're at Home Goods, I'm trying to vlog and all this stuff, right? My father calls us like, your girls, the dogs ran away. And we're like, oh man, y'all should have seen us. We just kept going. <laughs> we just kept shopping. Cause we're like, you know what? They do this a lot. They know the way home. They'll be fine. That took us like, I need to fix this. That took us like an hour, right? To get back. We came back home, we're waiting for them. That was two hours ago that this happened. Well, two and a half hours ago. We're waiting for them, we're just chilling, we're talking. All of a sudden I get a, a signal from the air tag that's tagged on them that they're home or they're close to home. So we drove over to where they were. Two minutes later, we found them. And these dogs are acting like, yeah, we just went for a quick run. Thanks for letting us in. They're so annoying. Now they're home. They're not coming in this house. They're gonna have to be in the backyard. So I have to go open up the door for them. You guys, this backyard is getting renovations done or getting things construction done to it. So like we have concrete and we're gonna have concrete on this side as well. Kind of leading to the gates. Okay. Bomb, let the prisoners in. You guys are kicked out of the house. Look at them. Look at them. Look at them. Are you nasty? Yeah. Come on. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have to figure out when to come. Let's go inside. Yeah, we have to. I have to plan it to come back here tomorrow. Should we rinse them off real quick? Can we get a shorter month? And I can buy it now. Go in your prison because you're not going inside the house oh man i don't have time <laughs> you want to go swimming right <laughs> why y'all wrapping yourselves around lucy's like all right yeah just help me out by shaking off <laughs> bella where are you going <laughs> Oh, it's broken. Yeah, I know. No! Get out, loose. Get over here. Get Belly. your butt. All right, I need to shake off at this point. <laughs> Lucy's like, I don't even care. <laughs> She's really. She's just making me run. No, Lucy's dealing I'm, with it. Lucy, just do Lucy for now. She's 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 dealing with it. Belle is so dramatic. <laughs> yeah. Water on my body. Oh my god. Even oh my though god. I even oh, though I didn't oh, just, oh, just oh go god. swimming. Oh my god, water. Oh my god, water. How'd it break? I don't know. Probably Simba. Chewing on it. Or Bella. Are one of the okay two. Now? It's just, you went swimming. You're not scared of water. She's such so a... don't pretend. Like, you want to know why you're wet? Because you went swimming in water. Like what? Like dirty water. Would you rather have dirty um, water We're spraying you? you with clean water. Yeah, no, this is, this is, no, this is what we're gonna do it tomorrow. Like just shake. No, like when we when we want to get them wet, just yeah. All right, that's good. spray them and then shampoo. Oh. Uh oh. All right, girls, shaky, shaky, shaky. so rough now i'm back home i just wanted to show you all what i got from home goods um i got two bins like i really did really well shopping today at home goods i only spent 30 dollars. yeah and only because i bought stuff for like myself and my, my mom so they just got a new stove look at me back there hey girl 
as you can see i have brown pants on because i had to switch what i was wearing because i was looking for the dogs whatever <sighs> i got my mom a cooktop cleaner they just bought a new stove so i wanted to get her something nice for the stove so she can use to clean it and then i bought myself a stainless steel to be cleaning my fridge right here right right, right there <laughs> And then, hold on, let me show you this. Hey, y'all. Okay. Yes, I'm vlogging on my phone right now. Again, I got this. Because I really wanted something to consolidate everything in a cute manner. And I already had that one, but it's so small. And it came with this set right here. It came with it. And it also had the two. And when I bought it, it was actually, like, a really good deal. Anyway, this is for my towels, like, my hand towels. And then I got, I already had this, I mean. So I wanted to keep that together. And then I just wanted something bigger and cuter and more concise. Ignore all this. <laughs> more concise. And because I'd already had something black over there with the pompous grass, that vase. I'm like, why not just, because I found this at Home Goods for $15. And I'm like, it's cute. It'll work with everything. It's just better. So I'm like, yeah, that looks better. It's a much, it's a much more cleaner um, vanity now. But today was supposed to today was supposed to be my cleaning day my editing vlog day my vlogging day my content day and his all that went out the window okay went out the window the girls took two hours out of my day and it set me back so i'm just now getting home i'm about to clean up a little bit do my laundry and go to the gym and then meet up with a friend later i'm tired i'm actually tired and i'm really hungry and i've been saying I'll go to the gym, so I'm gonna go. I haven't been able to go all week because it's just been a really, really rough week. And me not going to the gym is not helping either because usually I get out all my stress in the gym and I love the gym, but I couldn't make it this week. Anyway, I'm gonna try to go with the little energy I have left. I don't think I have any energy left actually because I need to eat. Ooh, the other thing I got, I got two bins. Okay, so I got these two bins as well. They came in a set, and y'all, I got them for $10. $10, both of them, because I wanted to have something. It's going to be organized cuter. I just wanted to dump everything in. This is just miscellaneous stuff that I have. This is all my laundry stuff, because everything in here is kind of like gray, white, and they're all different, but they still kind of work. That's all my hair stuff. It's fine, but I found these gray ones for $10 like i love me a good deal and the fact that i went in there thinking lord i just need a bin that's ten dollars to just put all my stuff in but i found two for ten dollars come on god come on jesus that's how god be working okay i'm just saying i really love how that looks right now i need to mount this and i need to find something better to put it up right here to just give it a focal point because later i want to get a mirror right here like a cute mirror to just maybe right here because i'm short like right here so i can always see myself before i leave the house because this is the entrance door anyway that was just really cute the way it looks right there but yeah i'm tired and i'm about to talk myself out of going to the gym but i'm gonna go i need to go so i'm trying to like get myself back up so i'm walking around like doing everything so i can actually go change do what i need to do and work out for a little bit because once i sit down it's over it's over for you, okay? It's over for you. And that's cute too. My friend Tom right here got me a fruit basket, a fruit bin, whatever this thing is called. Got me that, it's so cute. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, oh no, okay, whoa. Hi. <laughs> Dang, you can see it on my face. Y'all know I'm pulling off the chair, I'm about to sit down and talk. Hi, oh my God, why is this light so harsh? Okay, and hi. Okay, okay, okay. Since I last vlogged, I think it's been like two days since I vlogged. <sighs> yeah, therapy is on Friday and I'm kind of excited because I feel like I should just extend it to like a two hour session. That's what's been going on. Anyway, I'm I'm not in the best mood. I am not myself. I have been trying everything I can to be in a positive headspace, but the enemy is trying. But I also think it's because I have been very lackluster in my 
my walk with Jesus recently. When I say lackluster, I'm saying like I was here and I was supposed to go here, it felt like. And then I just said, me. <laughs> Ooh. All right. Like I dropped the ball on my daily devotional and my daily affirmation. Like I did my devotional, but I didn't do the whole thing. You feel me? Like I didn't do my affirmation. I didn't do my worship, which I usually do. But I also think it's because I'm getting used to working from home in this setting, like my own setting, which you would think, as in like my own place, which you would think like, oh, it'll make it easier for me to just worship. But I wake up and I'm like, go, 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 go. Get things done. And because it's my space, like, I want things to be clean. So if I see one little speck, I'm like, okay, wipe everything down. So then in my mind, like, my day's already started. So I'm just trying to get myself back in my routine or, like, create a new routine. A reset, if I must say. A reset in my own space, living on my own. Just resetting what life would look like as a single woman living on her own and trying to develop a healthier relationship with God. Because what tends to happen sometimes is, I guess we're gonna have a chit chat, okay? I'm already talking. What tends to happen is, which is bad, and I think we all kind of like fall short of this, we all do it. When you start parallel, when you start making a parallel between your relationship with people and God. And God is like babes. Like, I love you more than they do. And I have to remind myself that, like, just because this person is treating me this way and their walk with God is a little bit, in their eyes, better than mine. I'm so shady. Um, in their eyes, better than mine, then they must be right. And then God must be feeling the same way, too. Meanwhile, I wasn't convicted of whatever they're saying of me. Meanwhile, God didn't say that about me. Meanwhile, God is telling me, honey, baby, sweetie pie, that's not what you are. That's not who you are. So I started to do that, and I fell into a spiral of doing that. Then now I'm, like, trying to come out of it and remind myself who I am. And just, I mean, it happens with age, with experiences, is you just have to, like, redevelop yourself i think it's kind of like when you're playing a game right okay you're used to one type of you're used to one level you have the arsenal for one level right and then now okay well, you've passed that level now you got to go somewhere else then you got to build more arsenal just to maintain that level and keep fighting to keep up leveling right and i think that's where i'm at it's like i need other arsenals like i need other things stronger things that means like I need to go deeper in my worship. I need to go deeper. And I feel like that's what God is calling me to. Like, hey, honey, babe, sweetie pie. I don't know where that came from. It just came out. But <laughs> honey, like, you want a relationship. You want better, healthy friendships. You want an actual intimate relationship with a man. As in, like, genuine my person. Like, I want my person. And he's like, you want all that, but you're neglecting me. This just got real vulnerable. And that's another thing. I stopped being so vulnerable with myself. Like, I don't know how to, like... And I guess that's why vlogging is helping. And, like, y'all know, like, when I start talking like this, it just means I'm very uncomfortable and I don't know what to do. So, like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to the 10 people who watch me consistently, thank you so much for being here and for watching and for supporting I am so sorry for my kookiness and my craziness. Forgive me. I should have my mic on. I have not been using my mic. And I keep going on a tangent. That's how uncomfortable I am to be vulnerable. Anyway, but yeah. And it's like, I just know I need to be more vulnerable with myself. Like, I don't like this feeling. I can't even say that to myself. Like, someone can hurt me and I can't even be vulnerable in that situation because I feel like I have to conceal don't feel <laughs> if you know where that's from conceal don't feel your feelings just so like people don't like you don't ruin the vibe with people or like people don't think you're so emotional or you're such a victim like i hate bringing out emotions because i've gotten all those things and it's like dang i thought you were my friend that's why i was telling you how i feel but you're gonna call me a victim i don't feel like talking anymore but yeah 
back on the topic. I've gotten so used to, oh, Lord help me. I've gotten so used to just hiding my feelings, even with myself, like what more God? Like I can't even go say like, hey, yo, bro, honey, father. Did I just say honey? <laughs> I can't even go say, God, like, this is hurting me. Like, this sucks. Like, I feel guilty having feelings. I feel ungrateful. I feel very ungrateful when I have my feelings. And when I'm going through things, like, how dare you? That's how I feel. Like, how dare you be feeling like this when God is giving you so much? And it's like, no, I am very grateful for everything. But everything still comes up subconsciously everything that i've been holding in my spirit man is saying get it out <laughs> get it all out like you can't take this into a relationship so yeah i'm literally supposed to well, i should have gone to the gym like it's what time is it nine o'clock it's nine o'clock at night usually i would have been back got my what's it called protein shake like last night i got back around like 8 30 from the gym and I got in and I just laid on my couch and I didn't feel like doing anything. And I know when I start being so like lackadaisical, is that the word, whatever. When I just start being like so nonchalant about everything, I know something is wrong within myself, like deep within me. Like, yeah, I didn't even feel like eating. I have no appetite and I know I'm hungry and I just have no appetite. And me when I'm stressed, annoyed, sad, food, what is food? I ignore food. People say, why are you so skinny? Because of stress, okay? That's why I'm so skinny, because of stress. I work out to cover it up. I have muscles, but I don't eat. That's bad. It's really bad. So anyway, I'm going to go to the gym, because at this point, vlogging has become my personal journal. So welcome to the journal, <laughs> even though I'm not giving you enough or anything for real for real it's just helping me speak about it so whatever what i really came on here to say was all of that and that i'm about to go to the gym just to get myself back just to get some dopamine level my uh neuro not neurotransmitters i guess those two not me trying to use my degree um yeah, I'm trying to increase my dopamine level because I am just really not in the mood right now. Like, all this smiley that I'm doing is me being an F expert at pretending that everything is okay. So, y'all, yeah, I'm going to go to the gym, make myself feel better from that, increase those dopamine levels, okay? And I'm going to come back. Hopefully, I have enough energy because I got some songs to write, okay? I have been... <sighs> How I get out my feelings is through songs. So I have a whole bunch of like lyrics just flowing through my head and I just kind of want to play around with it. Even if it's not great, I'm going to give myself grace and just write what I want to write. But yeah. Oh, earlier today I went because my neighbor upstairs is very loud. Like all I hear is noise and every day. And I went to kind of like ask one of the one of the um, leasing agents down here is like, I'm cool with them. So I was just talking to her like, hey, like, is that like normal? Is this like just thin walls, whatever? And she was like, nobody lives above you. And I was like, that's a lie. She was like, yeah, you think you got ghosts? I was like, can you imagine? Can you imagine? God forbid. I was like, I got to start praying this place down. And I was like, what do you mean no one lives above me? She's like, show me the floor plan. I'm like, what do you mean no one lives above me? I hear them. Like, I'm not crazy. I don't have ghosts. She was like, yeah, I think you have ghosts. I was like, don't do that, bro. God forbid. Anyway, <laughs> like what? Anyway, I don't have ghosts. I actually have neighbors above me. Imagine hearing you have ghosts. I rebuke it in Jesus' mighty name. <laughs> Not here. <laughs> anyway, we're going to the gym. Let's see if I can show you. This is from... This right here is Fabletics. And I think my leggings, let me go back here so you can see it. Oh, nope, you're not gonna see it. Okay. And I think my leggings are from Target. 
Yeah, and this is just a mix and match because they both have sets. That's all. They're two different sets. Anyway, we're gonna go to the gym and come back, and hopefully we have more energy. Honestly, vlogging also helps me get more energy because like I'm getting it out. Yeah, so thank you guys for listening and being my therapist and hearing what I gotta say. <laughs> thank you for being here. I'll be back. Hey friends, hey lovies. Okay, so today is Saturday. I didn't really vlog this week. I did, but not really. So this week's vlog is gonna be kind of short. It's fine. I'm about to close it out actually, but I was gonna have a whole date night plan for myself, a date day for myself. I woke up today and I was just like, I'm tired. Like, look at my face. And I was supposed to do my hair today. And I'm like, I'm tired. This is the same hairstyle. It looks really raggedy right now. It's fine. We're going to figure it out today. I'm probably going to just take out my hair later today and wash it and just kind of pull it back. But I've just been sitting on my couch watching TV and cleaning. And to me, that was just like the most relaxing thing I can do. Like just cleaning my spot and just doing laundry. Like I've had laundry just piling up because I have not been home the past two weekends to even do anything. So like today was my day to just usa come back to myself clean like i clean my kitchen it's clean clean the sink i clean the cabinets it's and now i'm treating myself to a little afternoon tea charcuterie situation afternoon wine just yeah relaxing i'm about to drink wine i didn't pour the wine yet but i just wanted to come on here and check in with you guys because i have not really vlogged this week the vlog i was supposed to be editing i had to stop editing it because as i said before the dogs ran away <laughs> so i had to stop editing but we're here we are here i'm about to relax it's just weird to be relaxing it's so weird i really want to have a conversation about that because why does it feel like I'm cheating on myself or I'm doing something wrong by just resting? Oh, I even cooked, guys. Like, I made, ooh, not my thing breaking. I made Alfredo pasta. The lighting is not helping. But what else did I do today? I made Alfredo pasta. I made stew last night and I finished everything else this morning. I got my HelloFresh, so I'm gonna be making HelloFresh later just for the week. Like, I'm prepped for the week. I'm ready, okay? And I was gonna go to Starbucks, but I didn't. I made my own Starbucks at home. Ugh, very adult, very adult. Anyway, I'm about to enjoy this charcuterie and relax and watch television. Do y'all watch Archer? Archer? Why am I, I can't speak English anymore. Do y'all watch Archer? That's my show sometimes. Like, it's like a guilty pleasure, weird pleasure, I don't know, um, that I've been watching lately. I used to watch it when I was younger and then I'm back on it. So that's all I've been doing, just sitting here cleaning. I'm really about to eat charcuterie and fold laundry. <laughs> what am I, a mom? That's really what I'm about to do, yeah.